Hello my friends, I know you have seen this race before, but because a lot of you enjoyed it so much, you've requested me to do this race once again, so hope you enjoy. Hello my friends, my name is LazyJet and welcome back to Train Simulator 2019. Today you join me in another race and this is a race you guys have been wanting for a very long time. We have the city of Chiro versus the flying Scotsman. So we have two special steam engines who apparently city of Chiro was the first one to do 100 miles per hour but you know flying Scotsman was the one that was recorded. So we're going to see which one is going to be the f it's gonna, it's gonna be the best, who's going to win at this fantastic race. So it's like the final showdown between these two fantastic steam engines and as always i'm going to be driving this the superclass 47 again so what we're going to do is we're going to go to the editing uh well world edit and i don't know if you guys can see this because my big webcam will be in the way but i don't know if you you can just see it. it's just literally right above my head i don't know if you guys can see that but you click this little stain button and then click yes so let's program city of churro i think it is uh city of churro yep to do a hundred percent power and flying scotsman to do a hundred percent power as well so this is like the final showdown between the past and the past the past and the past because both of these are steam powered so it's basically the past versus the past so it's made no difference really but which one of these is going to be faster i mean i think I think Flying Scotsman is going to be faster, I think, I could be wrong, but as I said, you know, I'm going to be driving the Superclass 47 so I can catch up with these two fantastic engines, so let the racing begin, oh, I'm really excited, it's nice to be back doing racing again, I have missed this, so in three, two, I'll do it, press yes to, 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 to race, racing time, let the racing begin, and Flying Scotsman, is pulling away quick car, then the City of Churros, that's good, so let's get our Superclass 47 ready, and away they go. So we only need to give a little bit of power. Ooh, ooh bit of a bumpy start. <laughs> so City of Churro has fallen behind. Goodbye, City of Churro. Looks like Flying Scotsman is going to win this. There's a little 9F there. Hello, little 9F. I don't know what that's doing there, but there we go. Oh, Flying Scotsman. Hello. City of Churro has fallen behind, and Flying Scotsman is doing over 50 miles per hour. Let's try and catch up. So I think it's doing around about 60. It's in the 60 zone. Yeah. Oh, no, she's speeding up. Oh, I think she's in the 70 zone. Uh, yes, we're doing 72 something miles per hour. And I think she's still speeding up. I think she can get 100 easily. Reminds me of that live stream I did the other day when I was driving Dutch of Sutherland and I got out to 111 miles per hour. That was a great live stream. So City of Churro is left far behind and Flying Scotsman is doing roundabout in the 80s zone. Oh, hello, look at this. City of Churro's catching up. Oh, what is this? What's going on? Oh, look at this. Wee! And City of Churro just smashed Scotsman. I want to catch up with City of Churro, see how fast she's going. She's doing in the 100 zone. I think City of Churro is doing around about 110. I'm almost, like, sort of in sync with City of Churro, and it's doing around about 111 miles per hour. That is much faster than Scotsman. And there's Scotsman. Oh, my God, look at Scotsman just left way behind. She's like a tiny little speck. You can't really see her anymore. And here's City of Churro. Oh, look at Churro. Look at those wheels. And I do apologize for how laggy it is. It is very laggy. But I have got to say that the City of Churro is a fantastic looking engine, I think. Oh, it's just so gorgeous. And just over there, I think, it is that's the Flying Scotsman. Oh. So if we go in the Superclass 47, I think we can just see... There it is. There's Scotsman. Hello. God, look at her. She's just, she's far behind. Poor Scotsman. Just seeing a little distance. Oh. So here comes Chiro, and there goes Scotsman. Scotsman's got a long way to catch up. Sorry, Scotsman. She's not even, I think she's just entering the first corner, I think. Yeah. I still can't believe I actually had the chance to see and stood on that engine. Yes, yeah, Sam, one of my fan meetups, I did actually stand on City of Chiro, and it was actually very nice. It was a, it was a very good cab, I think. It was a very, very comfortable and very homely. Well, I wouldn't say homely, but it was a very nice cab, I think. Sio Chiro does have one of the nice look. I mean, if you look at her cab, actually, like her cab is completely exposed to the outside world. Actually, let's look on the map. Let's press 9 and have a look on the map. So we are here, 
And there's Chiro, looking nice. And where's Scotsman? Scotsman, where are you? Oh, she's still on the... She's still this first first bit of um, bend, the first curve. Look at that. It's going to be a while since uh, Scotsman's going to get here. And here we are again at the end of the line. Can we apply our brakes just a little bit? There we go. Um, oh, our Superclass 47 doesn't actually want to work. It's got no power. I think I've broken the Superclass 47. We've got no power. Hello? I have broken the Superclass 47. That's, not, that's that's weird. That's never happened before. Hmm. I also love how it says max speed, 95 miles per hour. <laughs> I don't think so. This thing can touch uh, 400 very easily. But look at Chiro just gently rolling to this to, to the finish line, as as we say. Look at that. Beautiful. It's actually a really nice looking engine, I th I'd say. I mean, it's not. I mean, we're just proving it's, it's way it's way faster than flying Scotsman, weirdly. But there we are. Just pop it there, Chiro. Very nice. And here's my engine. We're gonna apply the brakes. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that was qu that was quick. That was close. But look, I mean, we've got no power. It's not going forwards. It's not going backwards. I've broken the Supercast Forty Seven. This has never happened before. I wonder what other things I can break. But if we look in the distance, I think there it is. There's Flying Scotsman in the distance. She's still on her way. I think she's still doing around about 80 miles per hour. But unfortunately, she's lost. Flying Scotsman has lost this race, which is a big shock. Hmm, a very, very big shock. But congratulations to City of Chiro for completing... Well, actually, no, for winning. For winning this race challenge uh, thing. So well done, Chiro. You've done really nice. Well done. And here she comes, ladies and gentlemen, Flying Scotsman has been beaten by City of Chiro. And the buffers keep disappearing, I don't know why that keeps happening. But here she is, Flying Scotsman, welcome to the end of the line. And sadly, you lost! Which is a shame, because Flying Scotsman is my favourite steam engine, as you all know. But there we are, that was our race challenge of City of Chiro versus... Chiro? Chiro, sorry. City of Chiro versus Flying Scotsman. Um... If you guys um, prefer, well, if you guys leave an answer of what you would prefer, would you prefer City of Chiro or Flying Scotsman? Leave your answer in the comment section below and I'll, I'll, I'll read it. But thank you again so much for watching this interest, well, one of my Train Simulator races. And I hope you will join me again in another Train Simulator race. And until then, have a good evening. And remember, it's all about the game. See you next time, my friends, and have a good day. Goodbye.